Hello and welcome to Video Jug. In the kitchen is our American chef Richard Myers, who is going to teach us how to cook Cajun seafood. Today I'm going to be showing y'all how to cook some Cajun shrimp. Well, first off, we're going to start by getting the skillet nice and hot. Well, I'll be adding a little bit of extra virgin olive oil and a little butter to the pan. That's to keep the butter from completely burning. The olive oil will separate and it will keep all the water solids from truly burning. We've smashed the garlic. I've minced it in small pieces. We're going to be taking this rosemary. I'll be peeling it and just slightly bruising it. Very important to use fresh in this because otherwise the dry just stays, uh, it just doesn't really work with this dish. Next step is simply to peel, leave the heads on, but you're, what you want to do is peel the outside of the body of the shrimp, leaving intact the back. Once you cut it, the shrimps are going to get tough. My oil and butter is nice and smoking. I'm going to start to add the prawns. And as I add the prawns, I'm going to also add my seasoning on top and the seasoning will toast with the prawns. Once you have your seasoning on the prawns, you turn them over, re-season again. The reason I didn't start doing that is because it would start to burn. Now we'll be adding the garlic and rosemary. We start to add the flour, dusting it and creating almost a roux. As I'm turning the prawns over again, I'm actually cooking the flour. And now we're gonna be ready to start adding some liquids to it. One of the little secrets is a little bit of Liam Perrin's Worcestershire sauce. I think it came from England. And the other one is a little bit of Louisiana or hot sauce. Tabasco may be too strong and it has quite a bit of vinegar. So we try and use one that has a little bit more flavor of the chilies instead of that powerful vinegar taste. So now I have a good amber beer, courtesy of a few friends of mine, and we'll be finishing the sauce with the beer. Now the beer will have a little bit bitter tones to it. So, but the, the sweetness of the prawns, the spices all come together. And then pretty soon we keep stirring and this dish is done. Five minutes max. And that's how you cook some Cajun shrimp. <laughs>